good day and welcome to today's construction class my name is Oluwa Tumbi Blessing or La Lekon, the founder of Michael Tech today we'll be considering the problem as displayed on the screen okay the figure above shows the front elevation and plan of a right cone cut by a plane gg draw full size d a given elevation b complete plan c end elevation looking in the direction of roy so the very first thing is to produce the given elevation and to do that i'm going to produce uh, a thin horizontal line in this order like this after producing that i'm going to uh, produce a vertical line this also to it so after producing the vertical line we are told that the uh, center height is mark of 75 which is this mark 75 which is this and the base is diameter 60 so from the midpoint towards the left 30 towards the right 30 all right so i'm going to join that faintly first of all like this and like this all right yeah after doing that so uh at a mark of 20 from the midpoint here mark of 20 i'm going to project the line horizontally towards the left hand side like this so from that mark then at the mark of 40 on the midpoint this is the mark of 40 right here on the midpoint i'm going to project this faintly horizontally like this okay so then i'm going to now draw the cutting plane which passes through each of this portion like this So, and that is my what my cotton play G and what G. So, G, G. So, here is my full front elevation like this, like this, and like this. All right. So, that is it over there. Okay, so for the plan, I'm going to pick a distance of 10 mm first of all. All right, then I'm going to actually draw this like this. So I'm going to pick my compass and measure radius of 30, like this. Okay, radius of 30, which is the midpoint today. Without radius of 30, I'm going to stand right here, like this. Strike an arc here. Then from this junction, I'm going to what? draw my plan so drawing the circle on the plan i'm going to divide that plan into 12 equal parts into 12 equal parts so how do i achieve that i'm going to achieve that by first of all dividing into four equal parts all right then from four into what into 12 equal parts okay so having it like that i'm going to name this mark zero one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven and mark what is over twelve okay after doing that the next step is this i need to actually get the complete plan how do i get the complete plan so i'm going to project uh each point on my plan to the base of the elevation the zero and twelve ends here mark one and eleven the line on the same vertical plane ends here at the base mark two and ten ends right at the base there mark four and eight ends right at the base mark five and seven ends right at the base then mark six ends there at the base right there okay so from that junction at the base okay i'm going to drag everything to my apex this is already at the apex so mark five and seven to the apex right there like this mark four and eight to the apex right there mark two ten to the apex right there mark one and eleven to the apex right there so after doing all of that so i'm going to now start tracing it okay from where those lines touches my cotton plane this is my cotton plane gg so where this line touches the cotton plane i'm going to trace them down so for the first mark here mark zero and twelve i'm going to what bring this down so this way it touches my what my zero and twelve right there then followed by mark what mark one and eleven which is this i'm going to what pull it down also it touches my mark one and eleven right here and right here can you see that so mark 
2 and 10 right here like this yeah so pulling this down this mark 2 and what and 10 all right so mark uh 4 and 8 which is this 4 and 8 4 and 8 mark 5 and 7 which is this 5 and 7 which is this okay okay oh there's an error there it's five and seven here so five and what seven right there then mark six which is the last mark mark six which is this downward and this what mark six so having it in that order i'm going to what join each of those points all together i'm going to join each of those points all together like that all right with my french curve okay okay so that is the shape gotten then i'm going to what section it since it is a solid object like this okay so i can now take in this okay can make it tick like this and that gives my what my complete plan that gives my complete plan so after doing that the end elevation look in the direction of ROY so hey this is my ROY okay this is the direction of ROY right here so how do I get my end elevation I'm going to actually produce a line from this point at an angle of 45 degrees like this at an angle of 45 degrees like this okay so doing that I'm going to project it like this to this uh, from the bottom like this to this okay then uh, from this area this here. point here I'm going to pull it upwards like this touching the base there so this center line will be pulled all the way to the top like that okay then this all the way down here like that okay after doing that ish. Ish. okay so I'm going to project the highest part of my point G, the apex, down here. Okay, so each of the points here, where it touches the truncated part, I'm going to project them towards this direction like this. So the first one here, this is what? 0 over 12. The next one, this. This is what? Uh, mark 1 over 11. The next one, this. This is mark uh, 2 over 10. The next one, this, this is mark 3 over 9. The next one, which is this, that is mark 4 over 8. The next one, which is this, that is mark 5 over 7. And the last one, which is this, which is mark uh, mark six. Okay, having each of those points over there. So then, from this area on my base, I'm going to drag it to the apex right there, faintly, faintly. Remember, faintly, and this also right there to the apex. Now, after doing that, so each of these points also i'm going to pull them so mark this area here is mark what mark nine right this area here is mark what mark three so this center line is mark what mark zero over six over twelve so i'm going to pick mark ten and eight also horizontally mark four seven and eleven sorry mark seven and eleven horizontally mark five and one 
are on the same horizontal plane also like this then mark two and four on the same horizontal plane like this also okay having those points in that order okay i'm going to pull them to the base like this like this like this like this okay pulling them to those areas like that so from the apex right there to the base i pull faintly okay i pull from here to the apex of vertex i pull from here to the apex of vertex i would i pull so this is going to be mark 11 over 7 11 over 7 this is going to be mark 8 over 10 this is going to be mark 1 over 5 this is going to mark what 2 over 4 now 3 on this area aligns with 3 on the horizontal plane they meet here they meet right here take note 2 on this area and where is mark 2 on the horizontal plane this is mark 2 here this is line for mark 2 and with 2 they meet here they meet here okay 4 where is this 4 on this line 4 on this horizontal plane is here it aligns here are you taking note of that so mark one one on the horizontal plane aligns here right here mark one aligns here one mark five aligns with what with this here mark five here mark zero over zero zero where is zero zero over yeah this is zero zero aligns with zero here and twelve zero and twelve zero and twelve aligns there so mark six this six here. six aligns here so 11 and 7 11 aligns with 11 here and where is 7 it aligns with 7 here so 8 and 10 8 aligns here and 10 aligns here right here then mark 9 9 aligns with 9 here right here so i'm going to join each of these points all together that gives me my what my curve okay my end view yeah so that is the shape the end view actually brings so we are going to actually section this at 45 degree also at 45 degree like this okay like this so that is that about that this is a front view this is a plan and this is the complete end view of the figure displayed on the screen kindly ensure you subscribe to this YouTube channel and also refer it to your friends who might be in need of it my name is Uluwa Tumbi Blessing Olalekon the founder of Michael Tech thank you